Hi, welcome to Jingo Academy. This is Johanna Bonilla. I'm Technical Product Manager for Europe, and it's my pleasure to introduce you our Jingo Solar Top Cup technology. So, let's start. First of all, you have to be aware why we trust in this technology. Jingo has been developed with this technology since 2017, establishing several world records that we are very proud to hold. The latest one is 26.4%. So we have started with P-Type, and all of these records, most of those, are based on top cup technology. So this is important for us because this is what we say to our clients and to our um, market, that we trust this technology because we have invested a lot of research and development, a lot of uh, efforts in developing this technology. So what is this technology? Top cup technology, as you can see here, it belongs to the second generation of anti technology. So Jinko has worked in the past with the first generation and we are ready in the Topcom technology second generation with our products. This technology is an alternative to other options that are in the market, but Jinko has chosen this path due to several reasons that I will explain you through this presentation. So first of all, as I explained, we have to invest a lot of money and effort in the research of this technology, establishing several records in 2017. What you can see here is the difference between a P technology and a TOPCOM technology. So since 2017, there is a gap which is clear for us, providing more efficiency for TOPCOM. As you can see, the P type curve is already in the saturation point meaning that the technology cannot deliver more efficiency even if we make efforts to improve that. That's why the step is needed. So we need to have another technology to be able to bring to the market better efficiency and of course better power. What can we do now is already a mass production of 25%. So this is important because this is already in our product lines. Our theoretical limit is 28.7%. This means that we have still plenty of room to do improvement and bring a better product to the market. And in combination with several uh, advantages like the LID that is not existing in this technology, LID is light induced degradation, or the LED, which is light elevated temperature, all those degradations do not have an effect in this technology, meaning that we can have up to 3% more power generation. Allow me to introduce you the CELTEC technology. So a TopCom technology looks like in this diagram, and key of this technology is the ultra thin tonelac oxidized layer. This layer is actually adopted at the rear side of the structure, and it improves the selectivity of the cell, allowing a better activation rate, less impurities, a better thickness uniformity, and also a better carry conductivity. At the end, what we mean is that we will have a better efficiency and, of course, a better real performance in outdoor deployment. So, a short introduction of what actually we have done. So, we have combined the processes of P-type technology that are very well known in the manufacturing uh, part, and we have improved our technology by adding the ultra-thin tonelite oxide layer. This is our key component for ensuring a better um, selectivity. The selectivity means that we will have less losses, as you can see here, because we allow the majority career to pass, but we also have a lower career recombination, which means also that we can reduce the losses. So let me introduce a bit our products. We have in our product our Tiger Neo series. The Tiger Neo series use, of course, our TopCom technology already in the 2.0 version of it. We have a high set called technology, which is a very known technology in the market with a lot of maturity, and this is why we trust it. We also use a slim multivascular technology that allows to improve the performance of the cell by reducing the cracks possibility. And we are very proud that we are always improving parameters, and one of those parameters is the temperature coefficient. Our temperature coefficient is 0.29. Uh, the uh, percentage per degree Celsius, and this is key for many locations in which temperature plays the major role. Uh, but I will explain those advantages in the next upcoming slides. 
What we have uh, provided to our clients is covering all the scenarios possible of applications. So we have products designed for utility at scale, like the 72 or the 78, but we also have products for our commercial and industrial applications, and also for our residential applications. So let's take a look at the modules that we have offered. This is only an example because our portfolio, we are proud also to announce that we are launching new products. But I put some examples just to show you what we can offer. So we have a 70A module in monofacial and bifacial version. So we have both dual glass and monofacial. The same for the 72. And we also have our 60C, which is more for commercial and industrial applications. All of them have different power achievements. We have different sizes, suitable for the application scenario where you would, would you take these modules. But we also have the possibility to offer a large power range, as you can see. What are the advantages of our products? So let's start with one that is very key, which is the warranty. Our warranty has a clear advantages compared to any PTA traditional product of the market. This starts already by the first year. So in the first year, you can see only half of the degradation of a standard module, only 1%. And then we have an annual degradation of 0.4%. So what you see in green is compared to pair all the advantages that we can offer with our products. You can see also we have five years on top to a standard model. At the end, this will also enhance your LCOE and your uh, project security. When it comes to bipartiality, we also have an advantage. Our p type products traditionally offer 70% of bipartiality plus minus 5%. And now with our token, we are able to offer 80% plus minus 5%. What does it mean? When it comes to real deployment, of course, this means higher bifacial gain. So with these modules, because of the technology, you can improve your energy generation and take the most out of the bifacial technology, only due to bifaciality. What you see here is an example of a high uh, deployment. So we have put in this uh, installation p type against Topcom, and we have varied also the bifaciality. And you can see that the increase of energy is 2.03%. This will vary depending on the scenario and the location, but from the technology, you already have an advantage compared to any P technology. The next one is our optimized temperature coefficient. So we have now 0.29%. This means for us a better performance in real conditions. What we have seen here is how we can improve, and uh, we have done this during the past of years, from polycrystalline to monoper, and which X technology, this temperature coefficient has become better. At the end, in real deployment, we also see that the modules operate with around one degree less compared to a traditional P technology, and this means at the very end, just better energy and less losses. Another thing is our enhanced reliability. So we have put our modules to extreme conditions in order to ensure that they will perform in the best way in the real outdoor deployments. What you see here is an example of our 78 Tiger Neo dual glass. And we have tested thermal cycling, damp heat, LED heat, LID, PID, and some of the results are in this plot. So our PETA technologies also went through those extended testing. Both of them performed better than the requirements of the, of the IEC standard. But you can see a clear advantage in green of our Topcom technology. In all the tests, they have less power degradation. And this also means that they will respond to those extreme conditions in case they appear in real outdoor projects. Another key advantage of our product, especially for locations with low sunlight, is the better low light performance. What this means is that the modules can respond better even if the sunlight is not that well, like in conditions with high irradiance. What we are showing here is an internal uh, laboratory 
test comparing our n-type product against our p-type product. And at low irradiances, like 100, 200, actually it starts from 600, the modules start already generating energy, so they have a better efficiency. This means in real world that we will get an advantage of about two hours of more energy because at early in the morning, at late in the evening, the modules will start producing. From the small details of the modules, I also would like to introduce you our use of light. We have a high use of the, of the light because all of our portfolio will make benefits of the circular ribbon. So we have tested several variations of it and we have, after analyzing the results, chosen the circular ribbon because it, betters, it gives better uh, use of the light, especially when inclined light, like you see in this graph, and also because the reflected light could be used better. At the end, this small change makes our technology better when it comes to very till angles. So, as a summary, the combination of the optimized temperature coefficients has explained now we have 0.29% per degree Celsius. The combination with that uh, bifacial uh, factor, which is actually better, 80% compared to the beta, which is 70%. And also, the fact that this cell per se is not having light-induced degradation or let it, we can achieve up to 3% more energy in our projects. And this is something that we are very proud to, to say, to communicate, and we can also demonstrate with our real already projects that are running since last year. Together with that, as a client, you will also benefit of our power warranty. As explained, we will have five years on top compared to P-type. We will have a better degradation for the first year, only 1%, and we will have 0.4% annual degradation. On top of that, you can rely that we have put our modules on to extreme conditions to prove that they have a better performance and a better reliability compared to our products of the past. And not uh, to, men, to forget to mention that also we have improved light efficiency and appearance because also we have different versions of our products, so we can uh, tackle different needs of our markets. I just want to close uh, with some additional information, which is we also care about the real outdoor deployment of our of our modules and we care about the results. So Jinko has started a campaign worldwide to test our modules in real conditions at different locations and find out what are the real performance of those modules. We have different conditions as you can see here, some in France, in Italy, South Arabia, Malaysia, several within China and also in Australia. Those projects are ongoing and we are collecting the information to provide support for our projects, for our clients, and to also offer this uh, option to, to have further information from our models. We have basically focused on a comparison of our P-type products against our M-type products at different levels. So we have string connections or only module connections, trackers or fixed structure. So I just wanted to show you one example of all those tests so that you can see what are the real results. Here we compare our Tiger Neo 72 against our Tiger Pro 72 in this condition, which is actually a temperature uh, continental monsoon, and we have seen the power gain. So basically the modules in average will have more than 4% compared to the PTA. This is only an example of what can models achieve in real conditions and Jinko is very confident of the performance, has collected a lot of information and we can also provide this additional to our clients. So just to close and summarize, TopCon is the new technology that Jinko has deployed already at the mass production. We are investing still in the research and development and we are quite confident of the results because we already see them uh, from our clients and from our own testing. So thanks for watching and thanks for today.